Today, let us take you around the life boat. Different ships have different life boats. They may be David launched or free fall life boat. In the olden days, open type life boat were also used. These are hardly used these days. This is how the life boat looks like from the forward. And this is how it looks from the aft. And this is how it is from the bottom. Let's start off with lifeboat David. A David is used to lower and rise a lifeboat. The two David arm swings out and lowers the lifeboat by means of a fall wire. The David also consists of the control box for operating the David, the winch drum around which the fall wire is stored and lashing wires. As you can see, the fall wire is passing through the structure of the David to the fall block. On the other side, we have the winch motor, the handbrake lever to lower the lifeboat from the embarkation deck. This is the embarkation ladder used to board the lifeboat when it is waterborne. The fall block is attached to the lifeboat via the release hook. On operating the lever inside the lifeboat, the release hook is activated and lifeboat is released. This is a close-up view of the fall block. As you can see that the block rests on a horn attached to the David, thus the weight is of the fall wire. Prior launching, we have to release the harbor pins. This is done by removing the securing pin and releasing it. There is one at the forward and aft also. As we enter the live boat, we can see the seating arrangement, including the seat belts for each personnel. The capacity of the live boat here is 28 persons and it is constructed as per the capacity requirement of the ships. The command center of the live boat consists of the steering wheel the throttle control, ignition, the magnetic compass, and switch for lights. What we see here is the release mechanism and release handle. This allows to release the release hooks situated at forward and aft of the boat. The live boat is driven by a diesel engine that gives us speed of about 6 knots in calm water. The lifeboat also has a bilge pump which removes some water collected in the lifeboat. There is also a DCP dry chemical powder extinguisher in the lifeboat to fight fire. The lifeboat has hatches at the forward and aft to access the release hook so as to reset them while heaving the lifeboat. There are storage spaces for lifeboat equipment. Let us see some of them. The Boyne Bailer Used to remove water from the lifeboat. A life-saving manual Giving survival instructions at sea. It has various information necessary for survival at sea such as important stars, life-saving signals, ocean currents, etc. Lifeboat drinking water, sufficient for each person on board as per lifeboat capacity. The lifeboat food ration, sufficient for each person on board as per the capacity requirement of the lifeboat. It is a solid bar type of food item. A vessel to attract attention in case of a ship passes nearby. A torch with sufficient spare batteries and also spare bulbs. Seasickness tablets for each individual. A dipper to grab and sample the water bed when necessary. A daylight signaling mirror so as to attract attention of nearby vessels by reflecting sunlight. A rescue quiet used to rescue a person. A multi-purpose knife. A hatchet, 
a graduated drinking vessel to ration fresh water, a first aid kit, a fishing tackle. This is used for fishing and mainly to improve the morale of crew when they are out at sea in a live boat waiting to be rescued. Can openers to open food cans. There are three can openers needed as a requirement. A rainwater collector that can be installed and collected to replenish drinking water. A radar reflector. This is installed so that the lifeboat can be detected by the radar of another ship. Hand flare. It is a pyrotechnic which can be lightened up in case to attract attention of nearby vessels. There are six hand flares in a lifeboat. A buoyant smoke float. This is also a pyrotechnic used to attract attention of nearby vessels. There are two smoke floats in a lifeboat. They are opened up and released to the water and float upon water with a bright orange smoke. A rocket parachute flare. These are also pyrotechnics used to indicate presence of a ship in distress. They shoot up a flare into the sky which can be seen from a distance. There are four rocket parachute flares in a lifeboat. Seasickness bags sufficient for every crew member. Buoyant oars like the wooden one to move the ship in the event of where engine breaks down. The grab hook used to grab anything such as a rope from a ship during rescue operation. A sea anchor used to stabilize the lifeboat in rough seas. Well, that's all about Lifeboat. Hope you like the video. Subscribe for more interesting videos. Thank you.